Hey guys, welcome to BHO Rab and BHO Motors World. Um, this is our very first project we built. Um, it's a replica of Southampton Football Club, St. Mary Stadium. And basically, Rab came up with this design when he was watching Southampton play on TV. So, basically, this is what we went with. Um, I'm going to show you the inside of the stadium and the fans area and so on. So, let's get this started. Um, basically the front, Rab did that part of the stadium, I left him to do that because it had been pretty tricky for two, I would have probably messed it up somehow, so left that to him. Um, I see we got SFC in the foot, in the floor, um, one of our mates did that, we thought it looked good so we left it. Um, we have a reception area here with some chairs and we have our change rooms back here. I'll we'll go behind here to get the change rooms, I'll take you up there, I'll take you behind there once I show you up in the VIP boxes and uh, um, offices first so I'll quickly run up there and show you that and hopefully with this new update coming out we can add some more to the stadium so it looks pretty so we can make it look a lot better um, these are offices we have basically the same design from apart from the end one I'll just show you that one quickly um, it's a pretty simple design food out stadium. Um, this is the main office. Um, if we wanted to add more as well, we could also add some more rooms if we wanted to. But yeah, it's a pretty simple design for the stadium. Um, so again, what we had is what we made use of really. Um, and this is our restaurant. Um, small, but it would do. So I'm going to quickly show you guys the VIP boxes. Um, I'll take you up to the main one first, which is this one. Um, we basically just built a food stand here. Um, and we put the entrances, entrances to get into the VIP boxes. You've got to go under. under we built a tunnel under here. When it would be enough room, we put a corridor. So I'll quickly show you these. They're all the same, apart from the last one, so I'll show you that one and this last one down here. And then I'll take you down to the dressing rooms and show you that part of the stadium. Get a good view from here. So, yeah. I'm going to quickly take you down now to the dressing rooms, ref's offices, and, and yeah, I'll show you down there. Um, again, took probably uh, took us probably about... We would have stuck at this build, we would have probably done this within four weeks. But we just got distracted with other builds around the world. So it's been so we've only just finished it. But this is the change of rooms. We have the home change rooms here. Um red and white representing the colour of the team. Um we have the toilets. We have physio room here. We have jacuzzi, some showers and we have again the chest dressing room um, we have a ref up this is a ref office we haven't put anything in it yet um, we have two of them because it's pretty small so build two quickly take you down here to the away dressing rooms here we um, have some toilets again physio jacuzzi shower all the same stuff as the other change rooms not really that much difference. Maybe the feeding room is a bit smaller than that one, but that's about it. I'm going to take you now to the fans part of the stadium, which we'll get to from outside. Basically, this is basically the only way you can get into the middle parts, the fans area of the stadium. It's through these doors, or you can get in some other way. I'm sure we can. But yeah, these are our turnstiles. Um, I came up with a design, it's been tweaked a little bit by Rab as well, um, basically you can't get in, if these doors shut you can't get in unless somebody pulls the lever which is in this little room around here which I'll show you, basically a lever there and open and closes the door. And we have our program shop here and we have down here toilets, we have the men's toilets and the ladies, we have four of these 
on each corner stadium on each floor um, this is our food area we have where you get your food and drinks a little seating area here basically this is the layout through the whole stadium upper and lower simple design again hopefully the update will give us more to do so we can upgrade quickly take you back here maybe have to add some chairs here it looks pretty bare back here um, but this is the club shop some books in here to buy if you guys want to join my world one day you want to buy some books just come back here and you can buy some books um, take you up now to the middle floor which will be I'll show you the middle floor and then I'll show you just pitch from the, from the pitch yeah so I'll take you up here quickly you see tables and chairs again through out the stadium um, the main stand we have three of these I'll quickly probably I'll quickly take you over there and quickly show you that um, it looks I say it looks pretty but it looks a lot better I think main stand because we've got a bit more in there but this is sign around the whole stadium tables chairs tables chairs probably could change the floor in but it's not really a big deal at the moment I'm sure we'll probably end up tweaking this building once we finish all the other builds um, yeah so I'll take you out here to the pitch this is basically your pitch there's a dugouts tunnel view from here I think it looks pretty good basically we started with the stands first and the pitch and then built the stands up I think it's 20 high um, I can't remember the width and length of it rather have that information but this is basically our stadium I'll quickly run up here show you this part basically the same again so we've got more stands up we've got like three and some seats but yeah but that's about it guys this is our stadium um thank you for watching <laughs>